Attention, Bruce Gentry. Attention, Bruce Gentry. Your plane is cleared for a takeoff in five minutes. You have fine flying weather all the way to Los Angeles, Mr. Gentry. Yeah, but am I going to get off on time? What's to stop you? I'm waiting for a passenger. He's supposed to be someone important. Maybe he's waiting by the office. I'll take a look. Thanks. Pleasure. You're Bruce Gentry? Yeah. My name's Gregory. I was expecting. What gives with those men? I'll put it this way. Agents of a certain foreign power don't want me to reach Los Angeles. You don't believe me? I don't know whether I do or not. The man I'm going to see in Los Angeles is Alexander Benson, the scientist. Does that mean anything to you? Well, Benson's an old friend of mine. Good. I have a letter from him. That's his signature, all right. Mr. Gregory, my plane's at your disposal. I'll get your luggage. Fine. Official, but very important. You know that the entire Western Hemisphere is facing trouble. Yes, but the main attack is expected to come from over the Arctic Circle. No, we believe now that both South America are goals of the foreign power, and that the first attack will be launched against the Canal Zone. Well, that makes sense. Then they can either control or destroy it. Exactly. And certain countries on either side of it can be dominated by small pressure groups using sabotage, and perhaps a new weapon. New weapon? You have something in mind? No. But strange things are happening. It's enough to say that there must be the closest cooperation of all the Americas against the common enemy. Can't figure out what's wrong with these instruments. They're acting crazy. It's getting awfully warm. be that weapon you mentioned a few moments ago? Perhaps. But who would turn loose such a dangerous device without warning? I'll look into that after I've delivered you in Los Angeles. Dr. Benson. Welcome back, Bruce. I heard you drive up. How are you, Doctor? Fine. Fine. Won't you sit down? Thank you. 
I'm very grateful for what you did for Gregory. Is he still here? No, he made his report and left. He's a busy man. We all are. Did he tell you about the flying disc that almost wrecked our plane? Yes, and I've reported it to the proper authorities. <laughs> 